Hello there. It's Saturday and I am coming now to share these books that I got last night um, with you all. I got some fun books. Let's go through the easier ones first. Um, let's move these. I only got one, two, three, four, five, six, six books. Okay, so this one right here almost feels like a telephone book. It's big and fluffy and, you know, like a white pages. And it's the timetables of history. I'm not looking for it for the purpose of history. I'm looking for it for pages to add to a journal. So I didn't get a particular discount on this book last night at $5.49. But there are tons of pages and nicely colored pages at that. And I just basically bought this so that I can have additional pages to add to my journal. It offers all kinds of writing space. You know, somebody I'm sure is going to think this a very interesting book. Um, talks about all types of things. So history, literature, and theater. I should say history and politics. Liter literature and theater, religion, philosophy, learning, visual arts, music, science, technology, growth, and daily life. And so this is what this book is given. And it's talking about a timetable of history. So it says horizontal linkage of people and events. So for all of this book, $5.49, I think, was a pretty good buy, especially when it says that we should sell it here for $35 in U.S. Okay, so that's that book, and that's the purpose. And then this one is like it. I got this. I really didn't want to buy this one because this one was a little more, and... um. I was like, I'm not sure um, if I'm going to buy this. Let's just ride around with it while we pick up these couple pieces of sweat gear for my grandbaby. And let's see. So these have good pages, you know, interesting for literature, for people who might be interested in anything like that. Otherwise, it offers writing, no writing space, but it offers a lot of reading and different things that you can, you know, just take interest in. You know, it's just good stuff in here, I'm sure, because it's a literature book, right? Something that we would have used in school. So this is great um, additional pages to add to a journal. And um, that's what I bought this for. You know, some of them could even be, you know, tear outs and bookmarks and different kinds of things. Probably can make some page tabs out of some parts of it. You know, I don't really know. I haven't looked through all of it like I'm doing now. I just kind of thumbed it a little bit and that was it. But, you know, there's some pretty cool things in here, I'm sure. So I just grabbed it and um, this is what we've come home with and that was eight dollars but it's a lot of pages not that many um not that many less than the thick book because this is very very heavy so although that one was you know thicker it's fluffy and these are heavy and it's a different kind of paper that's like um the other one was like uh um what did i call it the white pages right and these are kind of a gloss type finish to them so it's, it's much heavier. So that's why I bought this one because, you know, some people have great ledgers and all kinds of fun book page stuff that they can incorporate. I have some ledger, but um, I don't have that many of them. And so once I use them, you know, in my yellow pages or whatever, I basically only have book pages. So that's why I got that. I'm going to save my best book for last, the one I think is the best, okay? Um, this one is A Gardener's World, The History, The Beauty, The Riches of Gardener's World. Okay, The Gardener's World. And this alone is a very nice piece that you can probably make. I probably can use this jacket, I'm thinking, um, to make something in and of itself. You could just use this piece 
and back it with some cardstock on both sides and even in the flaps and make this something and create a spine here. You know what I'm saying? And make this like a small folio type of thing. So that's what I'm thinking. Just cover all of this up with something else and this would be beautiful and it's already like caramelized a little bit. So this might be useful in and of itself. And here's the book. Very pretty. Nice book. Right? Because I want to I wanna get some more books that's like this and um and use them in full page. Not sure if I'm gonna do it anytime soon, but it's like in the long range of things. So that's that page again. We won't go through every page, but look how big and pretty that writing is, you know. So we have some things in here, okay, that we can use that's old, you know, I want to say like artifacts or whatever. Could be, maybe it's not, okay. But, you know, I saw it like that. And then here we go again with pictures that are cool and it's text on the back so you can cut them up. That's the kind of pictures I like to find in a book. Because, see, if I want to use this black and white, I have to sacrifice this. And that might be fine just to get these. You know what I'm saying? But this one, I would probably sacrifice and get that. So, you know, that's the kind of thing you got to look for when you're looking for these types of books. And then all of this, you know, just different types of wood and all that kind of stuff. I was like, oh, that's interesting. Cycles of life in the rosebud or some flower. Look at this. Isn't this lovely? I thought this was very nice. That's very nice that that be, you know, I um let me move this book up because sometimes I be having it just in front of me. I hope that you saw these things. Let's go back real quick. Let's go back. The other books didn't have that much to look at, but just in case somebody missed it cuz I have it all the way back here toward me. I just want to try and practice making sure I'm way up here so you can see all of the page. Cuz sometimes I don't do that. Okay, I need to focus. So, here I am. And these are the pages that I was looking at just now. These are the pages. And all this wood and everything like that. And that's that lovely bee. You see how pretty that is? That bee is lovely. Almost looks like it's on this same flower, but it's here. Two of them. Might be three. This looks like it could be a piece of one. Yes. And you did hear my door open. That's what it was. Okay, look at that. Isn't that nice? I love when it's like this and I can cut this and not, you know, lose something else. I love that. Okay, I'm not going to go through all of it. I know somebody wants to see, but I'm just going to show a little bit. Okay, all right, let's slide on back. Just nice pictures. Are these like lily pads, I think? That's what I think they look like, lily pads. I don't really know. What does it say? It says, among green leaves on blue water. Lilies, blooms, okay, that's what it says, okay, that's what it says, by still and running waters, okay, all right, so I guess it's chapter based where they have those type of things in, now this looks like a cabbage, and it is, okay, looks like a cabbage, okay, let's see what else we can find, let's go to the back, let's see what else, okay, I don't know, but somebody might understand these things to be nice. Okay, I'm not sure. But this is that book. Okay, The Gardener's World. Okay, then I have two small books. I have this one. This one's called Tiptionary. I was like, oh, okay, save money and time every day. And I was like, I sure need to be doing that. Okay, I sure need to be doing that. 
And this was very inexpensive, as you can see. So it's talking about family, food, home, money and finance, and then travel and auto. And I just thought that this might be good page, um, good page um, text and info for people to read and look at and think on and that kind of stuff. Just something fun, you know, make your own bread mix. I'm um, bread maker mix, brown sugar, butter spread, cafe mocha, and cappuccino. Okay? Special occasions. Plain cake to customize. Plate decorating. Presidential greetings. Santa, Santa sex. Rent formal wear. Progressive party. Different things like this. Family life. Uh, negatives and keep... Negatives in safekeeping, newsprint, our family, sturdy napkins, stargaze, skip first run, films, rehearsals, quality entertainment, portable toys. Okay? So that's the kind of stuff that's in this book. And I thought these might be fun pages to use. Just to, you know, put them in a, in a journal some kind of way. Okay? You need something besides just plain paper, okay? Some people only do paper, and that's fine. But I'm going to, oh, that's my good one. This one, this one. I thought this one was a cute one, too. It says, apples and chalk dust. Uh, dust, chalk dust. Inspirational stories and encouragement for teachers. Okay? Now, it's a nice looking book. Okay? So here we go. Let's look at what's in here. See that? This is nice. I'm going to just put this in a journal. Let people have at it. You know? Understand something. Might be nice. You know? I just thought it was good to put these kinds of things together could put this with a regular book page, you know, side by side or something like that. I don't know how I'm going to do it, but I'm going to do it in a way that I like, that I think is fun and is cool. So that's what I'm doing over here. Okay. I'm not trying to be like anybody else, just like myself. Okay. That's it. That's all I got. Okay. This book right here. This book right here is so nice. I was so happy when I looked through it because at first when I saw this, I was like, okay, that looked like um, the husk off of the corn and maybe somebody made it with some kind of tube or something. I was like, let's just look through it. But I could see it used to be at one thrift store somewhere for three forty three. I remember they used to mark it with this kind of crayon stuff. But I'm going to clean that off with some cleanser and and just use this salvage this jacket and then it's this way on the back and it was six dollars and um i think both of these images are very nice and useful and look at this isn't this pretty very pretty okay the book is like gold okay all right so we have this let me see something it looked like it got a little bit of water but that's just maybe it was moist this is a very pretty book. This is very pretty. I hate to even think about tearing it apart. So I might just and take this whole section out and save this book for something else. I wonder how much it cost the, um, the person who bought it originally. I didn't even look it up, but this is very nice. Okay, so we're going to look through this one. Okay. We're going to look through this one because I think it's very cute. What is it called? Fairy, fairyality, fairyality. This is so nice. Okay. So let's look. Look at this. This is vellum. Can you see my hand? This is vellum. It's very nice. I was like, oh, this is so cool. Fairyality, the fashion collection from the house of Elwand, Elwand. 
Okay. All of this is good. Y'all see all of this is good. Oh, this can open. Look at that. Look at that. I didn't know that. I felt something when I was turning the page. Isn't that cool? Yes. You can take this out and give that whole page. Just cover this part up and give that whole page. And then get those bulbs on the back. Okay? And this is textured. This is textured paper. Oh, it's so nice. Golly. Like like wedding, like wedding paper for invitation. Yes, it's very nice. Y'all see this? This is so cool. Let me come on down close. Okay? This is so nice. Oh, I haven't even looked through it all the way. I started in the back and then the middle, and I was looking at one or two pages. I said, oh, okay. Well, what's this? This a pocket? Oh. That's a pocket. It's a vellum pocket, but whatever is in there doesn't slide out. It's just there so you can see. This is the kind of stuff we make in the junk journaling space. Okay? How cool is that? Yes. It's stuck down, but you can't take it out. It's just in there. Okay. I didn't buy no vellum paper. I'm not buying none. I found a pack of vellum envelopes at the thrift store a few months ago, and I have that, but I'm not buying this paper no time soon because I'm not trying to do everything everybody's doing. Like, I've been saving the plastic that comes off of the uh, stickers, those kind of packs like this. I've been saving these because um, you can cut these and tape them or glue them inside of a regular envelope after you cut a window out of any shape and you can make it on envelope. So I've been doing that, but I'm not, I can't do all these things that everybody's doing. Maybe when I grow into it some more, but right now I'm not trying to do everything because I can't, I don't even know how to. So this is a flip through of some sort. Okay, let's see. Look at that. It shows you all these types of clothes that they created with feathers. And it flips all the way out like this. So that's one, two, three sheets. Cool. Giving me more ideas. Even though I see this stuff all the time. But, I mean, this is just like God to have me... You know, while I'm at the thrift store, I always look at the books because I don't know if I'm going to find something that's real cool, like an Edith Holden or something. I don't know. People talk about it. I'll be looking for Daphne, um, Daphne's Diaries. I'll be looking for that kind of stuff because I can't afford to buy everything. So that's just what that is. But my few little pennies, I try to stretch them out far. So this book was there, you know, like God wanted me have it. I started not to get it, but I'm glad I did. I started not to. Last time I was there, he let me find a field guide. I didn't know what a field guide was, but Pam always talking about her papers might have come from some field guide. And I sure was looking for one, one more yesterday, but I didn't find one. This looks like snake skin here. That's what this looks like. Okay. Maybe that's what it is. And look at these. I saw these in the store. Aren't they beautiful? Beautiful. But if I want to cut them, that page won't matter. I always look back to see. I bought some feathers. I have some color feathers. I bought them months ago, too. Okay, so I might have to lose this. I don't know. But, you know, that's what, that's what happens. That's what happens. So it's going to be okay. This is very, very pretty. Okay. Flight of Fancy. Now, all of this is hats, it says. All kinds of hats. Okay. How you wear them, I don't know. I can see that one being a hat, but, and that one. But that's what it say. H-A-T-S. Hats. Floating and flitting airy heights, take off, touchdown, cruising altitude, lighter than air. That's what all it says at the bottom. 
Okay. Isn't that pretty? And this is very pretty. The language of love. Some more of that paper that's like wedding paper. And then you have this in the middle. And some more clothing styles made for each other. So his and hers, okay? Look at this stuff. This stuff is something else. This is the the skirt is a carnival of stargazer lilies. The tops the top a wrapped lily secured by warmer lilies. By more I'm sorry, secured by narrow lily straps. Okay. All right. So they look like they're making all this out of some type of flowers and petals and great feathers and all kinds of things, you know. It's like, okay. Let's see this. He says, she says. Isn't that nice? Isn't that nice how that happened? That's so nice. And look at that. How beautiful. How beautiful. I wish this was on a page by itself because then you lose this, you know. That's so cool. But you could give this whole thing like this to a journal. Only that wouldn't go that way. It would just be here. And when it opens up, it's like, where's the other part? And if you give all that, then you lose that. So the things that make you say, oh, man, why? Okay, so... They look kind of cool, but I love that dress. Okay. I hope I can get through this before Walmart delivers the cat litter and the cat food, okay? Because then I'll have to stop. The Pansy Quartet. Okay. Oh, that's so pretty. That's so pretty. And it's the same kind of textured paper, and it's pretty. The fairy raids, double dates, sunset picnics, hide and seek, fly, firefly hunting, midnight dancing, moonbeam swims, musical evenings, nonstop parties. Then it says go that way. So I guess so you can follow where they happen. Fun and games. That's cool. That's a nice image. Nice, nice, nice. Oh, that's so pretty. Oh, so pretty. That's very nice. It's like grass, right? And look at these. Bathing beauties is what they call them. Very nice. Very nice. And then these are others, sugar and spice. I guess in everything nice. <laughs> okay. All right. This is so nice. This is a nice book. So glad I found this book. Look at that. That tree looks like a giraffe almost. I don't know if you can see it, the image, but... There is this leg here and here and this trunk piece and then this long neck. Looks like a giraffe. Very nice. Let me see. Oh, yeah. So most of these will be full page and I'll just fold them into a square. Yep. Look at this. This looks like corn husk. It's nice. Very nice. Very nice. It's now or never. Very nice. I love it. I love this book. I want that. I want that. Sashay Hike Tiptoe Scamper Dash. Shoes. Okay. Yep, I'm not going to really tear too much up in here. Because I have to make sure I give 
you know, the niceness. Tiptoe. Look at this. Isn't that different? Look at that. Some kind of leaf and some kind of stick. And that looked like some kind of bark or something like that. Mm, what does that say? The hot heel, a spike sandal that shows some toe, silver birch soles with pleasant, oh, with pheasant feathers and a pine cone heel. Okay. And this says the balancing X, the letters of birch bark covered in skeleton leaf, yellow grass strap, and a sprinkle of cow parsley seed. Okay. All right. Nice. Very nice. Very nice. Put your best foot forward. Oh, my. Oh, my. Okay. <laughs> All righty, then. Both of these is okay. First date. Okay. It says, Boss Boots, Flower Child, The Varsity, Desert Boots. Very pretty. This is very pretty. That's very pretty. I can use that in just parts. I mean, I could. I could. But we'll see. Mix and match. Okay. Nice. I like all of that. Now it's turning these. Okay. Uh-oh, I turned too much. Okay, and then is this. And turn that to here. If I pull it up, maybe you can see the whole thing, right? And then I check and see. Is there any more of those half pages, quarter pages? This is a nice book. Wouldn't you agree? Like, I want that, 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 and that. Okay, I don't lose too much for that. I'll lose the top of that. But I'll lose this if I take those two. Well, we'll think about it. I saw this at the thrift store. It's nice. These papers are really nice. I love the way they feel. Fairy tale wedding. Okay. Mother of the bride. The mother of the bride gown. That's the hat. That's the gown. Uh-oh. The groom. Okay. Lily Bridesmaid. The Maid of Honor. Lily Bridesmaid, the Maid of Honor. Flower Girl. Here comes the bride. Let's see. This is vellum. And there's her gown. Beautiful. Very pretty. Lovely. Just lovely. And that is concluding the book pages. And then there's this. Very nice. This is a very nice book. 
And so this then is my first video of today. I hope to be able to um, do another one. I said that I was going to decorate some pages, but I've been up this morning since about, I don't know, two, three minutes before six. And um, I'm still up and I have to go to the laundry. And so hopefully I'll get to do another one. I might do it before I leave. It depends because I'm still waiting on Walmart to deliver cat litter and cat food. So we will see. But I hope you enjoyed looking at these books with me and that they were, you know, fun and that you are excited about what will be coming up soon. I will talk with you guys, you good people, later on today or either on Sunday twice. That's what that'll be. All right. So have a good Saturday. Be safe. Stay well. Peace.